Grieving teenagers brought flowers and balloons to a wooded area in the Cuyahoga Valley National Park to remember 17-year-old Ryan Swiger of Cuyahoga Falls and 18-year-old Zachary Taylor from Wadsworth. Ryan was a junior at Cuyahoga Falls High School. His uncle says he was a loving and sensitive kid who played on the football team last year and was trying out for the basketball team. I loved a lot. I met a lot of people, you know. Um, I think he touched a lot of lives. Zachary went to the Schnee Learning Center, spending half of his day in school, the other half at a construction job. The school's executive director says Zachary was a kid with a big heart. He was a super, super, super kid. Um, was just finishing his coursework up last Friday. Uh, expected to graduate this year. The crash happened around 3 o'clock in the morning. Police say the driver was going at least 80 miles an hour when he lost control, slammed into some trees, and flipped over. A third teenager from Cuyahoga Falls survived and crawled from the wreckage. Officers have not said who was driving or where the teens were headed in the middle of the night. Sometimes kids feel that they're invincible, you know, and uh, I think they just need to take heed in what they're doing sometimes. Today, several counselors helped students at both schools. We've had about 30 to 40 kids in there. We provided some breakfast snacks for them and now lunch. Some of them are going home, some of them are staying because, of course, they're getting support from their friends, and that means a lot.